it was too time consuming for organizations to build new platforms yeah big data is all fine and dandy but there is an effort to build it there is an effort to bring it in there is an effort to harness the data then you'll have to re-platform re-educate your users so there is again latencies we are building in terms of time as we go through this exercise where does the exact you know middle ground lie for this kind of a situation right i mean on one side you have the data warehouse you spent a lot of money and you have business intelligence running on it good bad indifferent it is providing value on the other side you have all the data that is outside of the data warehouse which you've used to make the decisions that you made in your business that you want to integrate and be able to not only just visualize the data i mean there is there is an argument in the industry going on today saying you can create a mashup and visualize data it's not about just visualizing the data you want to be able to integrate the data at the data layer i think data virtualization is that middle ground with the data layer integration you are not only creating that integrated ecosystem where you can have that single plane of view of data across multiple systems you are not waiting for a real physical move to happen so when you virtualize the data the source systems in which these data artifacts are available are still used so they are put to task and those investments are leveraged and they are still harnessed and their their workloads if you will are still utilized but the result sets that they bring are harnessed into a virtual layer that abstracts the complexities that happen in each of those systems to the end business user now the question is is what opportunity cost are you going to miss what market is going to go past you what kind of insights are you going to not have because when you talk about federating a data warehouse or federating a data mart or putting a hub and spoke model in, in you have to physicalize those integration layers you're talking about latencies when you're in a virtual world where you're talking about result sets and mashing up the data at the result layer thereby creating a very strong platform of views where would you have a mess it's very very minimal if you will so if you look at the trend which is i need big data to make better decisions i need access to all the data to make better decisions that trend is satisfied at a fundamental level in a data virtualization platform now once you see that virtualization output you can then decide if you want to physicalize that and you still have the opportunities to do it you can still take all your data quality approaches all the metadata and all the master data interfaces you can do all that good stuff data governance if you will and still bring it in into either the data warehouse or into a big data platform wherever that final data at rest is but in between there is that business user sitting out there wanting all that information to make a decision that need that critical need is checked and that decision is going to always be a very accurate decision the power of this technology is going to be so big from a impact perspective that one better sit up and start taking notice it's not another shiny object that you need to add to your arsenal of tools in reality this is actually a technology that needs to be embraced and adopted so that you can startle between operational analytical and data warehouse worlds without crisscrossing any connectors in between or having to make any expensive physical investments in between